and welcome to my Nissan 350Z or Z if you want to be pedantic and British. Tonight we are heading to Ace Cafe which is just ahead of me for the JDM versus the world meet. So that's JDM or Japanese cars versus everything else. So it's a meet for everything but focused in Japanese that could be JDM but could not be JDM but also other cars. See you in there. I am not on display so I will not be able to park inside which is on the left. The Skoda thinks he is. He is the world part of the meet. Um, I, I, what, oh, he stalled it. It is rare to find a space outside Ace, but the last three times I have, because I'm amazing and early. So this R33 has had the decency to let us know how much power it is running. So we've got 547, it's got uh, active LSD. The R33 neighbors a 350Z, but as I said, we are early. So there's not a lot in here yet, but I think it will be full. We've got the MX-5 with the roundel on the side and an RX-8 pulling in, as well as a Subaru behind that. And next, quite early on, we have the first, yeah, hopefully of many, white Toyota Chaser of the night. We've also got this little Mazda that pops up as well. He's allowed in because everyone loves a white chaser. So representing the world section, we have this E92 M3 that has just turned up with its golden wheels. Wait a minute, is that what I think it is? Another white chaser? <laughs> We've got the IS behind that and a Mr. 2. It is starting to get dark, but arrivals are still being made. So now that it is darkening, a lot of the cars are coming out in the night. We've got this Lexus and a really nice 350Z. That's like a burgundy wrap. I can't tell yet under this lighting, but it's it's burgundy, like a 370 colour. We've got like the Nismo rear ends and deep dish wheels and tie writing. That is one of my favourites, these. And next up in the night, we've got a Mazda RX-7. You may recognise this one from various meets that it attends, white with the red wheels and a red E36 behind. And next we have this turquoise Zenki S14, one of the best looking cars so far of the night. This one's got quite a wild canvas set, so as you can see at the rear. So we're getting all of the colours tonight from the turquoise S14. We now have the great colour Dar 33. Also, you'll notice a Mark IV Supra in silver. But I think we have a pretty full cafe now. I think all of the cars are in here, and some of the cars are starting to leave, starting with one of the white chasers. We have a chaser leaving the show. Everyone's excited. Oh, an E36. Nice. to leave is this Lotus Evora. A very loud V6. It's actually purple in colour. There's a great amount of colours here tonight. So I get it, ultraviolet Lotus. That's what the place is. Very good. I'll look at 356. So from a purple coloured car to a uncoloured car, a grey S14 rolling through past the turquoise example. And next we have the regular at these meets. The exhaust is going to match the colour of the car in a second, I reckon. Yeah, knew that was coming. Notice to all scumbags, smackheads and lowlifes, no power tools are left overnight. Which suggests... Which suggests power tools are left overnight. Now we have a grape coloured R33 idling. I think it's on its way. There it is. Here it becometh. <laughs> From Skyline to Supra, the Mark IV is leaving next. Chaser, no pressure. 
to leave as well. We've got the S14. I'm going to move where the van was. There we go. Oh yes. Very, very static S14. We have a R33 GTI. He's been doing some revolutions. <laughs> he was in a rush. Celica so GT4 next up. And a beige Sora. This one sounds quite nice. It's quite nice as well. Mmm, Hawkeye. We have to get a picture because he's going to go, I think. And rather fittingly, if you have a look at the lights of this tunnel, this MX-5 over here is bringing Neons back, matching the tunnel fantastically, which is why he is coming this way, probably to get some pictures under the tunnel. There you go, the combo shot, the Neons with the lit tunnel. Very artistic, very nice. Ah, I see what he's doing. He's, he's matching the tunnel in a different way. Everyone's running to catch all the content. Here he comes. The next car everyone's getting excited about is this loud E36. It did the parts. Oh, he also is going towards the tunnel for some photos. It's very clean, actually. Very nice. And the final cars to the parts. We have a little convoy now. We've got the white RX-7. We've got the red E36. We have this R33, which sounds amazing. We've got the 350Z. I think the M3 is a few cars behind as well. Supercharged E92 BMW M3 manual as well. You'll have noticed. So that was pretty much that. We have an A Class and a GTA 6 left in here and, and some car of the lights on. So I hope you enjoyed that video from the JDM versus the world meet. Go follow me on Instagram for the updates and highlights and photographs from these meets that I go to. But for now, thanks for watching.